So this is a DVS Skate and Create. I don't know what, I don't know what year that was. Probably like 2005 or six. Yeah, like mid 2000s. Keith, hot photo. Oh no way, man. A one tray flip. <laughs> oh, dude, you shot that? Yeah. Holy shit. It's a day one. Tori Pudwell, little backsmith. Wow, dude. Oh my god, that's so crazy. Where are, where is this? It's, it's, in, a, like it's in a warehouse. Like, yeah, it's just huff, ollie ollie loop slide. Oh, man. It's pretty wild. Dude, he had one of the biggest ollies ever, dude. It was so sick. I remember they set up the uh, the shit and he's like, oh, we need to go a little, a little higher on that one. Add the box to it. Another Tory kickflip. Wow, man. He's crazy, dude. Yeah, these were shot on like a. They're nuts. These are amazing, bro. That's all those. Yeah, I found those the other day. I was actually looking for these a little while ago. This is all just film stuff that I need to go through. Yeah, these were. Uh, this was in uh, Cuba. I went to Cuba. Um, you know, Chris Naraco from NJ Skate Shop organized this trip to Cuba with some of the dudes from Skate Park of Tampa. We went out there and gave away a bunch of free boards to all the locals. I think we brought like a few hundred boards to give away. Um, these are all super random. Polar, that's my dog. Andre Page. Sitting at Tompkins. I <laughs> haven't <laughs> been through these in so long. Ron Diley from Jersey. Yeah, no, there's so much random. This was a Polaroid land camera. Oh, okay. It's like the little Polaroid that yeah. folds up. That was like these. They're kind of on some different ones. These ones with the lighting isn't as good or with the land camera. Some of these are just from a normal Polaroid camera. Um, fucking fleshing. A lot of these ones are from the Hasselblad, like, I had the, uh, it's Joey Pepper trying to backside flip a fence. But with the Hasselblad, you had the Polaroid back you could attach to it. Yeah, yeah. So you could kind of see where your exposure's at. Which now they have the digital back for yeah. the Hasselblad. It's Joey Pepper trying to ollie from this little lump in the road to this cellar door. Oh, I haven't went through these in so long. There's Eli. I think he was trying to know he knows one. On Blubba. Blubba? Yeah. I got a bunch that of... not Nolly backside? Is that backside? He's doing Nolly front nose ball. Oh. Last time. <clears throat> um, yeah, these are... Shit. So much stuff. Got some through. old stickers? Oh, nice, nice little bro. piece of cardboard. <laughs> <laughs> you must have liked it, bro. Where's this from? Uh, 82. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> 84, yeah. This photo of red on my man. Oh, wow. On this, uh, Thrasher art trip. So it was basically like, I went to Detroit, a bunch of skaters that do art. That's actually a funny story for the whole paper skaters thing, too. I was on a trip before that in Miami, and I showed up with, like, uh, like a canister, like an Epson film fucking big cardboard thing that had a bunch of paper skaters cut out and ready to paste up in them. Um, and the photographer on the trip was Joe Brooke, who shoots for Thrasher. And he was like asking me, he's like, hey, you want to go on this art trip? Um, we'll show your photos. We're going to like have an article on Thrasher. And he starts reading off the list of people that are going to be on the trip. And he's like, Ray Barbie, uh, Kid Adams, uh, so and so, this dude, paper skaters. We don't know who it is, but we really want him to go. And I'm literally like leaning up onto like onto this box that has like paper skaters yeah, cut out on it. And this is before like I told anybody that's what I was doing. So I kind of let him talk a little longer, and I was like, he's like, you know who that dude is? I was like, paper skaters. I was like, I don't know. And I ended up just like taking the paper skaters out of the cardboard box, and I was like, dude, that's I've been doing that. He's like, are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> oh my god! So this is. Uh, they wanted me to do a, a spread for the like front page of the article in Thrasher 
So these are like a bunch of photos I shot on the trip. They're all printed out and then I shot photos of a lot of the dude's art that was in the show. Printed them out small and kind of made them look like they were pasted up. But that was the the article opener. Um, wow. With everybody so that was cool on the trip. Yeah. Louis Lopez, Dolan Stearns, Jason Adams, Ray Barbie, Stefan Janowski. Wow. Yeah, it's pretty funny. I like, found this the other day. That's amazing. Uh. Oh, shit. This one's halfway cut out. <laughs> yeah, I was trying to make something out of this one. That's my brother fishing on the pond down there. This is a large mouth for you. Oh, <laughs> sick. Action. I cut it out. I was going to do something with it, I guess. There's an old UXA. Peter Hunt gave me that. Oh, this is actually a photo of Eli. <laughs> no way. A photo of Eli. Oh, <laughs> skitching. Wow. Yeah, skitching a cat. Wow, that is so dope. Dude. That's hilarious. I was shot on one of those Holgas, like the plastic. Yeah, the fish eye ones? Yeah. This looks like a wild well, I, had a, I had a fish eye taped to one of them. I had so many cameras, and it was like. I ended up shooting with cameras that weren't the better cameras because I'm like, be nervous bringing expensive shit on trips sometimes. Um, like I said, that photo was shot on one of these plastic medium format holders that I had like a fisheye video fisheye from the Panasonic oh the my God. taped to the front of this one um, but the Leica was definitely a camera I'd use a lot just point and shoots back in the day Nikon cool pics <laughs> shit like that um, yeah, some point and shoots this, this camera I've had forever this random Nikon was actually like a Christmas present from Don Brown, who's owner of Soltech, when I skated for Edney's. Hasselblad and the Leica are definitely like two of my favorite cameras. I would bring um, all the printouts like pre-cut, rolled up, and I'd bring like Golden Harvest wheat paste powder, and I'd bring the brushes, and then yeah, I'd just have, get like a soda bottle or something, fill it with water, and then if I was going to do a wheat paste, I'd just pour some powder in, shake it up and just have the stuff in the van with me as we were skating. And then I'd be like shooting photos of guys skating so then I, when I got back from the trip I could print them out and bring them on the next trip. It's pretty stressful just like trying to skate. I'm looking for skate spots. I'm trying to think of tricks I want to do and then I'm looking for wheat paste spots and then I'm trying to shoot photos of dudes skating and then I'm like trying to catch a tag here or there so my brain was just like <laughs> non-stop like going. That's what I'm wondering. I'm like, no, yeah, dude, you had like a bag, special bag packed aside from all your skate shit. And then I had all my camera shit as well so stickers, I could shoot photos. Stickers, cameras. Yeah, go to skate and then paste <laughs> and shoot photos. It was like, yeah, it was a lot, but it was exciting. Whose photography in skateboarding were you like, oh shit, I, sh I, I want to do this. This is dope. And as a <clears throat> skater, it's like, when I'm doing a trick, it's like I, I picture it in my head, like how I would want it to look. You know, like the angle and like yeah. where the, the pressure of the trick is, is going and where the photographer should be in a way. Um, so it got kind of frustrating at the same time too, because I'd shoot with some people and I'm like, in my head, I'm like, this isn't going to look good. Because in my head, I already got the <laughs> image of the photo I want. I'm kind of like, I'm not going to speak up and be like, hey, you mind shooting up from over here? Because they're there to shoot photos and that's what their job is, but... Yeah, just kind of. Any, any photographer in skateboarding that you're just like, damn, this dude's just a, it's just fucking incredible. Blayback's photos are amazing. You should check his stuff out. Shot a lot of stuff with Ken Block and a lot of different, a lot of dudes on dirt bikes. Shoots a lot of different stuff, but his photos, you see a photo of his and you know it's like from him. Yeah, yeah it's mm -hmm. like he just adds like a energy to it. Yeah, I'd say he's probably one of my favorites. When are we gonna see more paper skaters? Oh shit! Hopefully soon. I gotta. That's there's so much that goes into it. Mainly having the right printer and, you know, it's, a lot goes into it. Hopefully soon. I miss doing it. Kind of been trying to, been slowly working it onto canvases and I, I want to get back in the streets with it for sure. Now it's like, I'm trying to organize and go through all my stuff. Like I just moved from New York, so I have a box full of negatives. We kind of went through a little bit yesterday. Really just in to organize, 
organization stage and trying to kind of get all my stuff together to then move forward with making and creating with it. Our interests? Uh, Bitcoin? I'm playing darts. <laughs> yeah, I mean, crypto shit is definitely... I don't know, yeah, get into that, but... Uh, I've been playing darts a lot lately. Darts oh, really? Fun. Always uh, super into playing pool. Ping pong. Um, oh, you should play with pong. easy. I've been playing at my buddy's house on Tuesday nights. It's oh, actually cool. tonight, which you're probably going to miss. Sorry, Brian. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. All right, all right. Yeah, just once a week. That's cool. Which is... Yeah, it's fucking hard. Ping pong's yeah, tough, man. I was never into it, and you kind of get the feel for something, and then you kind of get hooked, hooked into it. Well, I feel like it's just like everything else you do, man. You're going to want to be doing like the fucking, yeah, like, the crazy yeah. top spins and fish, shit, right? I fish, yeah. You hunt? Do you yeah. hunt? Uh, I don't really hunt. I don't hunt. Um, I fish. Fish in the pond out here a bunch. I haven't been saltwater fishing in a while. Um, More yeah. fun to freshwater fish. Yeah, I like to just float around the canoe. Yeah. And it's so dope. It's relaxing. Yeah, it's so sick. I see your boat out here. You got like a little, was it yeah. a little bluffed whale or something? You got? Oh, that's my dad's. Uh, yeah, that's for not the pond. Yeah, yeah, no. But yeah, I yeah. seen like you guys like yeah, yeah. equipped over here to do whatever, you know? Big into fishing. Yeah, it's awesome, man. Fits and kind of be layered with throughout the colors. Wow. But 